Orthopedic Center of Illinois Sports Desk. We focus back in on the boys soccer postseason tonight as we have the final two regional semifinals in Class 2A with both local teams. Both of those games held at Meridian High School in Macon. So let's jump in and start with the first game, Glenwood against the host Meridian. So let's head there to Meridian High School. Game one, Titans and Hawks. And Glenwood, they would take full control, an 8 0 halftime lead. That allowed the Titans to go deeper into the rotation a bit, but they applied constant second half pressure. James Lee Jesse playing well in goal for Meridian. Titans on the charge here. Keaton Marconi, good run and well struck as well, but collected in goal there by Jesse. They would have another look here for Glenwood. Ball to Jack Evans. He's going to take a few dribbles and have a go. Nice bit of spin on the shot as well, but collected there by Jesse. Marconi, he's going to have another chance here on the wing. Taps into the box instead for Cole Hamilton, and he beats Jesse to find the final goal. Glenwood, after that ninth goal, the final whistle, they win 9-0. And after the win, Coach Frankie and senior Miles Calderon, they talked about the benefit of being able to go deeper into their bench today as well as their focus leading up to the regional final this weekend. It's real important because um, one thing is you never know um, Saturday if someone goes down, someone's going to have to step in. And it's tough if you haven't played for a while to step in in an important role. So it's always good to get players in and get them time. Uh, yeah, just, you know, uh, work hard in practice, uh, get up for every every day, just uh, ready to work. And, uh, you know, who, whoever wins here will play them Saturday. So, you know. They await the winner here in the second game in Macon Rockets taken on Warrensburg Latham. A physical contest this one, but the Rockets, they applied pr plenty of pressure. Landon Kutcher from ch the chance from outside the box, saved in goal, counterattack for the Cardinals. Brody Reed on the run, down the wing, on frame, but collected there for the Rockets. Now with a 1-0 lead, it's Kutcher, he steps up for the Rockets on the penalty and buries it. Confidence, cool, calm, collected, they extend the lead to two. Later on, free kick. It's going to be Carson Berberic coming up here. And he's going to send this one in. Ball seems to be diving, possibly taking a deflection, but it finds Twine nevertheless for the Rockets. And they make it 3-0. And they grab the win, setting up an exciting regional final date between the Rockets and the Titans. I know Glenwood very well. Uh, you know, neighbors, uh, I've coached a lot of their guys, and a lot of our guys have played uh, on the same club team. So, you know, it's 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 kind of a, it's it's a rivalry game. You know, out of the out of the conference, um, you know, it's it's going to be a high intensity game. You know, that's that's what a lot of those break down to. So we have the regional semifinals in 2A all wrapped up. Glenwood and Rochester advancing with both of their clean sheets. They'll square off this weekend as well as three other games. Regional finals featuring local teams in 2A. Centennial and Champaign Central, they match up. While Springfield High looks to beat Jacksonville in Jacksonville. And Muhammad Seymour, they take on Urbana in the final contest there. And shout out to Pleasant Plains in Class 1A. We weren't able to get video from this one, but they grab a win in their regional final over Lindenwood. So that one, a final of two to nothing. So congratulations to them. But for now, that's us for sports. I'm Sammy St. Jean. Thanks for watching. Stick around by subscribing today and don't miss a single video.